Keep calm, Chen. Fall back to the second defense line. You've got to hold out somehow. The fate of Gensokyo depends on this battle! Sorry to keep you waiting, Ojo-sama. Here it is, as per your request. Ah, so it is. Well done, Sakuya. At last, I can savor to my heart's desire the Hakure Shrine Maiden's Nose. very blood from Reimu herself! Huh? Yes? Um, Reimu's? Nosebleed. So you mean this is... Blood from her nose. Oh no! Hold on just a minute! You boasted about being able to get her blood without her noticing, so I left it to you! Right. I let her eat chocolates to her heart's content. Then I gathered the blood when her nose began bleeding. Like some old wives' tale?! I was sure you'd stop time and get some with a knife. Good grief. If I harmed her, her excellent intuition would notice right away. Besides, there's no difference in the blood from noses, is there? How bothersome. No, though drinking the blood itself is the biggest issue now. And what do you mean, bothersome? But it's true. Doesn't change the fact that it's Reimu's blood. Yeah. Still, drinking someone's nosebleed isn't for the faint of heart, is it? Ew. Going right back on what you just said makes you a psychopath! You're a psychopath, you hear me? Enough already. I finally get to drink Reimu's blood! What? What? What the hell is this?! Sakuya, my hands! Oh my. My hands. I heard someone got their hands on the Shrine Maiden's nose blood. It should surely become splendid vermilion for an incantation or ritual. Sorry, but Sega Nyan Nyan will be taking this nose blood. I get it. Vermilion. In other words, Hakure Shrine Maiden's nose blood, which holds an exceptional amount of spiritual power, acts as an ancient talisman against evil in Gensokyo. The color of vermilion has the same qualities. What are you talking about?! That's not all. If her nose blood were normal, it would not have such power. However, that cup is a forgery of the vessel which held a Western Messiah's blood, isn't it? To think you poured the Hakurei Shrine Maiden's nose blood into it. Because of that synergy, this is the result. It has certainly become an evil banishing treasure. It has become a deadly poison to devils and yokai like us. What? Why did Saki serve me such a dangerous drink? And isn't the cup itself pretty lame? I mean, I am a vampire hunter. Could you not spread Haida's gossip? At any rate, it's gotten to the point where we cannot leave it be or dispose of it. If it were to overflow, the nose blood would spread and stain the ley lines in the blink of an eye. Kansoki would become a wasteland where no yokai can live. Isn't that just pollution? Wouldn't that be great help for humans? Even if we were to destroy it normally, a single fragment or drop could have an impact. No matter where one hides, those looking to abuse that power will appear. Wait a sec, Yakumo. Can you seal this nose blood away with your boundaries or gaps? It is futile. Hakure Remu, in whose veins the nose blood flows, wields the power to simply dismantle any barrier, no matter the strength. If the vessel were to alter the nose blood, it would not be unusual for it to gain the same affinity. Even I can't say that my gaps and abilities are without flaws. To think the Hakure I spent ages establishing would be the destroyers of the land they were meant to protect. Some sage I am. Go on. Laugh. Hey, why are you giving up hope? You're joking, right, Yakumo? I don't want to see that coming from you! That's right! What has made you so timid? You don't have your usual shady grin. Isn't that the non threat? To the land that we gods love? What picked us up after our trials and ordeals? Were the ideals that you set forth. So spare us the whining! Now it is time to use our powers to the fullest! Ah, you all. That's right! Along with demons and yokai, we have those who have surpassed humanity and gods. Maybe our powers will have an effect on this noseblood. Ah, but my magic came from a demonic source. In fact, if it negates my power, I'll go back to being an old woman. I'd rather die than let that happen. Not having wrinkles is the best. 
You're being swayed by worldly desires, you damn nun! I only came to collect her. In the first place, the wise do not approach peril. Oh, sorry to trouble you, Crown Prince. The master has become the disciple here! What was with all of your cool lines earlier? Why do you even come here at all? Oh, I went out because of the paper. I'm just here to observe. You were into it a second ago. The paper? Sakuya! Oh, what a nice picture of me. What? You told her everything? That's why the evil hermit was here from the start. <laughs> Even when I'm doing my best, I can't boast a little. Huh? I'm the bad guy? No, wait. If it went badly enough to be in the papers, then Reimu herself is- You were found out long ago, yes. The second defensive line has fallen. The squad deployed to Yokai Mountain can't slow her down either. She is still on route to the SDM. I repeat, Hakure is still on route. Well, she is at that age, isn't she? If she doesn't want her nosebleeds and such to be made public, wouldn't she be seething as she retaliates, <clears throat> to put it lightly? Oh, this can't get any worse. Oh my. Hold on, Yakuma, why? Why are you defending against her? You mean the ringleader is among us? That's right. That would mean handing you all over to her. But don't worry. That's not where this story is going. That girl is undoubtedly coming here to retrieve and dispose of the Noseblood. But when she herself comes into contact with the Noseblood, altered by the Holy Grill, even I am not sure what will occur. Done poorly? Absolute destruction? No. It wouldn't be far off to say the reaction would be similar to the Big Bang. Gensokyo itself could be blown away. This has already become a critical battle for the fate of Gensokyo. What? It... It can't be! Oju-sama. All of this over some Knows. blood. To think this state of affairs was caused by a paltry amount of blood. All for Reimu's Knows. blood. All because I wanted some of Reimu's blood. It's no use. Misty Lake's defense unit has fallen too. She has broken through their lines. <laughs> hey, Yakumo. Don't forget that we're here too. That Nas blood is surely a product of divinity like we are. Does some believers treat me like a demon instead? I've got a plan. Could you open a fairly large gap? And... If it's isolated from this world using a boundary, perhaps we can defeat that nose blood. Still, if we were to create a sealed world ourselves, it could affect Ingenzokyo on the outside or the entire planet. As, As gods of heaven and earth, earth not, Not even all of creation will suffice. From, From the peaceful earth, earth to the heavens high above. Like time, down to the cell. Sakuya? I've got it. Within Yakumo Yukari's gap, we shall create a new temporary universe, and with my time, forge a new world. We can safely quarantine the blood inside. You catch on quickly. However, our presence would be needed to continue maintaining that world. We'd be saying a goodbye to this world. There's always a catch to these things, you know? Right. All for the sake of protecting this land from the blood. My world is the only one that can do it. I'm terribly sorry, but I leave this to you. Yakumo showing some gratitude now? Then give our regards and apologize to her as well. Getting cold feet now? Doesn't enjoying your second life sound fun? Well, I guess a third life means hitting the bubble. No! Wait. You promised. You promised, didn't you? I'm a mortal human, thank you. You'd be human as long as you live. But we'd always be together, too. Don't worry, though. We'll be together as long as I live. We agreed to that. We promised, right? But now you'll be going back on that promise if you do this. Sakuya... Thank you very much, Oju-sama. Because I am human, I can handle this blood. And because I am human, I can carry it away. Now is the perfect time for me to be selfish, isn't it? Thank you very much, Oju-sama, for hearing out my selfishness. Uh, how? How did it come to this? I... I... I refuse to accept this Shut fate. up, Oni-sama! It's that cup's fault, right?
Later. Oh, I'm going back to bed. Sheesh, what time do you think it is? Yukari-sana! The mixed defense team has been routed! The last line is gone! The Hakurei Shrine Maiden has infiltrated the mansion! Please evacuate at once! Please evacuate! Thereafter, with the unforeseen crisis averted, Gensokyo returned to its former tranquility. Many were wounded in the process, but through the residents' tenacity, they would soon regain their smiles. Though, as compensation for that, one mansion disappeared. Well, something like that. Since Fanchan was in the basement, she was... unharmed. Alright everyone, with that all said and done, today's incident was handled without any casualties. Now it's time to drink and forget it all! If you don't forget, I'll kill you! Cheers. You will succumb to the... Come. I will not succumb to the... Come.